Hello, today I'm going to show you some theory behind how gas analysis and sensors work. This green line represents an ideal sensor. To calibrate it, you would only have to know the ambient partial pressure of oxygen, that would be 21% or 0.21 bars in ambient pressure. Um, but that is not how uh, gas mixtures or how gas sensors usually work. They look something more along the lines of this. They're a bit skewed, you see? And if you were to take the measurement you did with 21% here and extrapolate it like so, you would end up with a measurement that is a bit off. This is the reason why we do two-point calibrations, one with low partial pressure, one with high partial pressure or high concentration. With this, you can take the two points, the two real points you measured, and put the line through those two. You take it, you extrapolate it. This is a much more real representation of this line. But if you're diving with hypoxic gases, you would need to do a three-point calibration and um, fit through them a quadratic equation, quadratic curve. This would be the most accurate representation of the real measurement, measuring capacity and abilities and precision of the sensor. Therefore, every time we recommend to do a three-point calibration, but if not, two-point calibration is sufficient if you're not diving with hypoxic gases and for really fast measurement of uh, close to ambient pressure, you can do one point calibration, yet still we recommend a two point calibration. Thank you for your attention, and if you have any further questions, please consult the user manual or send us a question through email or through Facebook.